In this problem, uh, we are told that angle B is 90 degrees and angle C is 90 degrees. That tells us we're dealing with a trapezoid here. If we know that BC is a length of 10.37, DA is 23.16, and AB is 10.46. So if that's what we know, what we can do to figure out the total area, we know that the area formula is one half the uh, sum of the bases times the height. So we know our height. We know our top base, 10.46. We don't know our second base, CD. Again, the height was 10.37. So what we need to find here is uh, this total length, CD. In order to do that, if we draw in a vertical line, creates a rectangle here where opposite sides are equal. So this portion would be 10.46 and this portion would be 10.37. We also created this right triangle in here. So in this right triangle, we have this leg of 10.37 and this hypotenuse of 23.16, so we can use Pythagorean theorem here. I'll call this A, and using A squared plus B squared, which is 10.37, the sum of the squares of the legs is equal to the square of the hypotenuse. And so we can go ahead and solve this problem. So if we took uh, 23.16 and squared it, and then subtracted 10.37 squared, that's going to give us a squared is equal to 428.8487, and extract the square root on that. When you extract the square root, and you get your value for a to be approximately 20.71. So if this is 20.71, we can find the total base that we're missing right here by combining those two lengths. If we add this to the measure that we uh, calculated from the opposite side, 10.46, get this length to be about 31.17. And so if we plug this now into our whole equation, we get uh, 0.5 times the quantity 10.46 plus this measurement that we just calculated. Close that off and multiply it by 10.37. And when we do, we'll get our area to be about 215.8. It would be square units. We have nothing labeled, so we just write our solution.